Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be going over a solution to a problem that some users are experiencing with your flap axis on the 737. So if you're using an external axis like a Bravo, a Satec, or a Velocity, and are having issues where your flap handle is not really doing anything inside the 737, here in luck because we're going to go over how to fix that coming up in today's episode of 2020 Flight Simmers. Welcome everyone to the cockpit of the newly released PMDG 737. So let's hop right into the fix for the flap handle and if this video does help you out, be sure to go down below, hit that subscribe, tick that little bell, and smash on that thumbs up button. Really helps us get found by viewers like yourself. So on your first time entering the cockpit of the 737, you're probably going to notice that the flap handle down here doesn't really move. So let's talk about how to solve this issue in the key bindings for the controls. So to get to the control section, we're just going to hit the escape key. Then we're going to go down to the control options. Once that loads up, you're going to click on your quadrant of choice, whether it be a Satec, Bravo, or Velocity. Once we have done that, we're just going to come over here to search by name, click on that, and just type in flaps. Once we do, you will probably have your flap axis bound to the 0 to 100 axis. What we're going to do is to clear that, so we're going to click on that, and then clear current input and validate. Next, we're going to go down to the flap axis below, click on the start scanning, and then move the axis you want to use for your flaps. Once that's completed, hit the validate button, and then make sure the reverse axis is ticked. Once that's complete, we can go down, hit apply and save. So now once we pop back in the cockpit, if we just move that flap axis, you will notice that the flap handle is now moving in the cockpit of the 737. All right, so that's gonna be it for today's video. If you guys have any questions or comments, post those down below in the comments section and I'll get right back to you. If you haven't done so, be sure to hit the subscribe, tick that little bell, and smash that thumbs up button. To all of my flight simmer friends around the world, keep the blue side up. We'll see you all in the next one. Thanks for watching.